Roger Gilbert Lancelin Green, the 2nd of November 1918 to the 8th of October 1987, was a British biographer and children's writer. He was an Oxford academic who formed part of the Inklings Literary Discussion Group along with C. S. Lewis and J. R. R. Tolkien. Topic. Biography Roger Lancelin Green was born in 1918 in Norwich, England, to Major Gilbert Arthur Lancelin Green 1887 of the Royal Artillery, and Helena Mary Phyllis, daughter of L.T. Colonel Charles William Henry Seeley, of Hambledon House, Hampshire. The landed gentry Lancelin Green family can be traced back to 1093, with the marriage of Randall Green sick and Elizabeth, daughter of William Lancelin, taking place in the reign of Elizabeth I. He studied under C. S. Lewis at Merton College, Oxford, where he obtained a B.Lit. degree. As an undergraduate, he performed in the Oxford University Dramatic Society's Shakespeare dramas produced by Neville Coghill. He was deputy librarian at Merton College from 1945 to 1950, then William Noble Research Fellow in English Literature at Liverpool University from 1950 to 1952. As Andrew Lang lecturer at the University of St Andrews from 1968 to 1969, he delivered the 1968 Andrew Lang lecture. Lancelin Green remained close to Lewis until the latter's death in 1963, and holidayed in Greece with Lewis and his wife Joy Gresham just before her death from cancer in 1960. When Lewis started writing the Narnia books in the late 1940s, Lancelin Green suggested that they should be called the Chronicles of Narnia. Lancelin Green lived in Cheshire at Powelton Hall, a manor house that his ancestors had owned for more than 900 years. He was lord of the manors of Powelton Lancelin and Lower Bebbington. He died on 8 October 1987 at the age of 68. His son was the writer Richard Lancelin Green. Works <laughs> 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 Topic fiction Lancelin Green became known primarily for his writings for children, particularly his retellings of the myths of Greece Tales of the Greek Heroes and the Tale of Troy and Egypt Tales of Ancient Egypt, as well the Norse mythology The Saga of Asgard, later renamed Myths of the Norsemen and the stories of King Arthur King Arthur and his Knights of the Round Table and Robin Hood The Adventure Adventures of Robin Hood. His works of original fiction include The Luck of Troy, set during the Trojan War, and The Land of the Lord High Tiger, a fantasy that has been compared to the Narnia books. Chronological order The Singing Rose and Other Poems Edmund Ward 1947 From the World's End 1948 King Arthur and His Knights of the Round Table 1954 The Adventures of Robin Hood 1956 The Book of Nonsense 1956 Two Satyr Plays Euripides Cyclops and Sophocles Ignutai 1957 The Land Land of the Lord High Tiger 1958 Tales of the Greek Heroes retold from the ancient authors 1958 The Tale of Troy retold from the ancient authors 1958 Mystery at Mycenae An Adventure Story of Ancient Greece 1959 Myths of the Norsemen retold from the Old Norse Poems and Tales 1960 A Century of Humorous Verse 1850 to 1950 J 
M. Dent and Sons 1959. The Saga of Asgard, retold from the Old Norse Poems and Tales Puffin Books 1960. The Luck of Troy 1961 Once Long Ago, Folk and Fairy Tales of the World 1962, Illustrations by Wojciech Kabasta Authors and Places, A Literary Pilgrimage 1963, Tellers of Tales, British Authors of Children's Books from 1800 to 1964 1965, Tales the Muses Told, Ancient Greek Myths 1965 Tales from Shakespeare Athenaeum 1965 Tales of Ancient Egypt 1967 Ancient Greece John Day Co 1969 A Cavalcade of Dragons H Z Walk 1970 A Cavalcade of Magicians H Z. Walk 1973 Strange Adventures in Time 1974, Editor, Drawings by George Adamson, J. M. Dent and Sons Limited, London, E. P. Dutton & Co., Inc. New York The Tale of Thebes Cambridge University Press 1977 The Beaver Book of Other Worlds 1978. Topic Biographies Lancelin Green wrote biographies of J. M. Barry, Andrew Lang, and C. S. Lewis. His new edition of Selected Tales of Hans Christian Andersen contains a short biography. He also wrote a brief biography of Anthony Hope as the introduction to a one-volume Everyman's Library edition of The Prisoner of Zenda and its sequel Rupert of Hentzau. He was editor of the Kipling Journal, 1957-1979. Lancelin Green was particularly interested in Lewis Carroll, publishing several books and articles. His book The Story of Lewis Carroll 1949 led to an invitation from Carroll's nieces, Violet and Manella Dodgson, to produce an edited version of his diary. This appeared in 1953, and has been at the center of the recent debate about the alleged Carroll myth. Caroline Leach devoted much space to considering it in her book In the Shadow of the Dream Child, claiming that something like 60% of the diary material was left out of this publication, and that Lancelin Green's allegedly partial, inaccurate and misleading editing had contributed to a continued misrepresentation of Carol in biographies and the media. At the time of publication, Lancelin Green claimed to have seen all the diaries and certainly gave the impression he had been allowed unrestricted access, however Leach alleges he later retracted this claim and admitted he had been forced to work with heavily edited transcripts prepared for him by Manella Dodgson, for reasons of safety. He was later a founder and vice president of the Lewis Carroll Society and helped Morton N. Cohen to edit Carroll's collected letters. Chronological order Andrew Lang, A Critical Biography e. Ward, 1946. The Story of Lewis Carroll H. Schumann, 1951. A. E. W. Mason The Adventure of a Story Teller Max Parrish, 1952. The Letters of Lewis Carroll, Two Volumes, 1953. J. M. Barry, Bodley Head, 1960. Lewis Carroll, Bodley Head, 1960. Mrs. Molesworth, Bodley Head, 1961. The Reader's Guide to Rudyard Kipling's Work, R. E. Harbord, 1962. 
Kipling and the Children, Ellick Books, 1965. Henry Treese, C. S. Lewis and Beatrix Potter, Bodley Head Limited, 1969, with Marjorie Fisher and Marcus Crouch. C. S. Lewis, A Biography, 1974, with Walter Hooper. Topic: Other activities and posts. Green was a part-time professional actor from 1942 to 1945, and a member of the Oxford literary group, The Inklings, along with C. S. Lewis and J. R. R. Tolkien. He was deputy librarian of Merton College, Oxford from 1945 to 1950 and William Nobel Research Fellow in English Literature at the University of Liverpool from 1950 to 1952. He was later a member of the Council of the University of Liverpool, from 1964 to 1971. 